Hello, in front of me I have Samsung Galaxy S25 and in this video I'm going to show the hidden sound settings on this device. Alright, so let's open up our settings first and now let's scroll down until we find sounds and vibration settings. Now simply scroll down a little bit into the bottom and let's begin with sound quality and effects. And so starting from the top we have the Dolby Atmos feature, we can uh, enable it, we can also mm, click right in here, you can read now how it uh, works, so experience breakthrough uh, audio for media playback that flows above and around you, in here we have four modes, as you can see we have the uh, auto, movie, music and the voice, so when it comes to the auto mode, uh, it optimizes sound automatically for whatever you're listening to, we have the movie mode, uh, it delivers the best uh, possible audio for films, uh, shows and videos, also the music mode, uh, so now the music will sound uh, richer, fuller and more balanced. Uh, and we also have the uh, voice setup, make voices loud and clear. So in here we can uh, adjust uh, anything that you want into your own preferences. Um, in my case I'm just gonna leave it uh, on the auto mode. Uh, below we also have the uh, equalizer. Uh, as we click right in here, um, as you can see um, we have this uh, chart, I think I can say it in that way. Uh, and we can adjust uh, everything manually, if we have that need. You can do it on your own, manually, select anything. Uh, we also have the uh, balanced mode, uh, best boost mode, smooth, dynamic, clear, uh, and the treble boost. Mm. As you click uh, on them, you can see uh, the difference and how they are changing, how this uh, chart is changing above. So, mm, for... Uh, I would say that uh, you need to test uh, all those modes and adjust mm, uh, the one uh, that you like the most, and the one which is uh, the most suitable for you. Uh, also, below you can read uh, how uh, each mode works. Uh, so. When it comes to the uh, balanced mode, a natural sound with well balanced frequencies, the bass boost, powerful lows at punch, smooth, warm and relaxed, dynamic, mm, exciting and energetic, then we have the clear, clean and precise, good for speech, then we have the treble boost, a vivid and spacious, good for instrumental music, and then the custom. Set the sound just how you like it. Okay, but in my case I'm just gonna leave uh, the balanced mode. Alright, so now we can go back from here, uh, and now uh, below we have another features, mm, and let me show you uh, how they work. So, uh, we have the uh, boost dialog, and we can enable that feature right in here. Uh, so now uh, it will be simply easier to hear voices uh, in videos mm, that have other background sound. Of course, you can read about it uh, right in here. Mm, also below we have the uh, loudness and normalization, it prevents sound from suddenly uh, becoming too loud or too quiet while playing media. You can also turn it on. Uh, below we have uh, up sound uh, settings, uh, but in here currently, um, as I'm looking, we cannot uh, adjust anything. Uh, below we have option to adapt the sound. We can click on allow, uh, turn it on right in here. Uh, so now, um, in here again, you can read uh, what this option provides. So, uh, basically the sound should be better. Uh, it also works when we are wearing the headphones. And now we can choose a preset um, that matches our age or take the hearing test. Uh, so now we can select adapt sound for. We have a media, uh, media and calls. We can also select only media or only calls. It's completely up to you. I think the media and calls, uh, you know, they are basically together. So I think it's the best preset. Uh, and now we can select uh, our age, uh, so we have the end under 30, uh, 30 to 60 years old and over 60. Uh, so under 30 it boosts uh, high frequencies, uh, one option below, it boosts high and mid frequencies, uh, and over 60 it boosts uh, all of the frequencies. Uh, so now we can select the option that we want, uh, but as we click on the uh, settings button right uh, next to it, uh, we can click on the uh, preview, but we need to connect headphones first. Uh, and now we can change uh, the preferred ear for calls. We can select left or right, and we can select the um, uh, sound preference, so it can be clear or uh, soft. 
Mm, we can also add the personalized sound profile. Uh, and here we have instruction uh, what to do. Then simply click on start and follow the instruction on the screen. Uh, Alright, I'm wondering if there's something more in here that I wanted to show you. Uh, we also have the separate app sound. That's the thing that you might not know about. Um, so we can play media sound from apps we select on a separate audio device. Make sure you choose an audio device that's different from your main audio output device. We need to turn it on, click on select, and now we need to select the apps that we want to play on a different audio device. So let's say we'll choose the YouTube. Okay, mm, and now we need to select the audio device that we want to use for apps we have selected. Uh, it can be phone or Bluetooth device. So for example, let's select the phone. And Basically, that's all. Uh, and of course, if you want to change it, you can always uh, do it. You can change the uh, preferable mm, audio device. So now, for example, we have the Bluetooth device for our YouTube. But for now, I'll just leave the phone. Uh, under the earring enchantment, uh, we have, uh, for example, the Mm, live uh, transcribe. Uh, so, uh, the live transcribe shows uh, this pitch uh, as a text on your screen so that you can participate in conversation and uh, around you more uh, easily. So, uh, I think it's pretty uh, cool uh, feature. And uh, we need to... Mm, mm, we can use uh, the uh, live one, but first I wanted to open it uh, normally. And click on uh, while using the app. Uh, and now, as you can see, when I'm talking to you, uh, my speech is converting, uh, is being uh, converted into the text. So um, you can see how this works. Uh, below, as you click, you can change the uh, language. Uh, if you want to, for example, change into Japan, uh, Japanese, uh, simply download it by clicking on that icon. Mm, and as you can see, some of the languages are still in the uh, in the beta. So you, you need to remember about it. Uh, okay, in here you can create a shortcut, if you click right in here. Uh, now we can choose uh, the function, uh, how we can, uh, what shortcut we want. So it's going to be quick panel buttons, uh, accessibility button, uh, site uh, and volume up buttons, or press and hold volume up and down for 3 seconds to launch it. So we can in here uh, select your shortcut that you want, uh, and that's how it works. We also have the live caption. Mm, so uh, now it detects speech on your device and automatically generates captions. Uh, so for example, mm, it's good for the YouTube and uh, when we have mm, when we are simply watching mm, I don't know the maybe the music or anything else. So it, it will basically uh, detect the speech mm, and convert it into the text. Uh, I'll show you that in a second. Uh, when it comes to the uh, settings in here, uh, if you want, you can mm, enable to hide the profanity, if you don't like bad words. So it will be replaced with that symbol, with the asterisk. And we can also change the caption preferences, we can sh uh, enable to show the captions. Uh, it's up to you. Below we can change the size and the style mm, of those captions. Right in here, you can select it into your own preferences. Uh, and when we click on more options, uh, you can change the uh, language. Uh, so now let me quickly show you uh, how it works. Um, I'll need to play something with the text. Okay, let's say that, that movie. That's uh, one of the movies from our channel. Oh, something uh, didn't want to launch. Uh, let me uh, adjust. Oh, because I didn't uh, enable it. My bad. Uh, make sure it's enabled, and now it should work. Uh, 
Okay, so as you can see, uh, that's the way this feature works. So basically, it converts the text into the speech. <laughs> that's its name, also. Uh, Alright, I think that's all in this video. Thank you all for watching. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like, comment and subscribe.